I'm not gonna make this very long. We just, uh, everybody knows this was a Sean's fire station. Um, and uh, it's not a day goes by, we don't think of Sean. You know, there's um, a lot of memories here. And uh, we thought it would be fitting to have something that we could remember him by, a memorial. And uh, a lot of ideas were uh, passed around. Um, there was talks about having something out front, closer to the ocean. But we, we, we found it fitting to have something at the entrance that everybody could see when they come into the fire station. Uh, something that, uh, that, that his, uh, his memory would live on. Though it's in our hearts, but we wanted other people to come through and actually take a look and, uh, and, uh, and see this. So with, uh, without any more, I'm going to have Eric uh, unveil it so everybody could take a look. Have uh, Chief Farius come up and uh, say a few words, and uh, we're going to be having uh, lunch following at, uh, at noon. So, Chief. Well, thanks, Sean. Well, as you can see, perfect timing. Uh, you know, the weather didn't cooperate this morning so much with the water and and the piles of dirt that we got here. I think everybody worked tirelessly trying to. Get rid of those things. I think this morning there was about 30 guys with shovels, and we said, hey, <laughs> let's calm down. It's probably not going to get moved before all this comes together. Uh, but you can definitely see the heart and soul I went into putting something like this together. And uh, today's one of those days where the world gets a little smaller, and you get reacquainted with old friends, and family comes together. And uh, a lot of folks came from, uh, you know, they're off time, and retired firefighters, and Michael already talked about that. Our EOD brothers and sisters are... Uh, visiting us today as well, and of course you guys are family coming, so it's a tough day. Uh, Michael kind of said uh, the heavy duty stuff down there, so I don't want to, because it is a tough thing, especially when you see the monument. Honestly, there's a few of us that haven't seen it on purpose until today, and, uh, and I'm kind of stunned at how uh, lifelike it is, so it gives me a little bit of pause here, but for the folks that put that together, I got to say, uh, hell of a job, you know, and uh, that's an amazing, amazing tribute. So, uh, you know, life is a little crazy. You never know what it's going to bring you. And day to day, uh, sometimes it doesn't seem like there's a lot of things you can count on. But the showing today from those uh, folks close and far, I mean, lets you know that there's something that's always going to be counted on. That's keeping Sean in the heart. Uh, and this tribute, I think, goes a long way to reminding us. It is a tough day, and especially for the family folks that are coming out here. Uh, you don't want to open up any old wounds, but we just wanted to, I think, show you guys how much, uh, you know, it meant to us. So I'll keep it short with that, and uh, we can uh, talk, discuss a little bit about how, how we're going to do the tour thing for you guys, because this is a great place. Uh, like I said, not everything came together perfectly, but I think it's the imperfections that really make things perfect, you know. And today's, uh, when we look back on it, it's going to be a beautiful day. And, <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's what it's all about. All right, so uh, noon time, we located the caterers. Yeah, we did. They're, they're, on, they're, they're getting way. inspected through the gate. <laughs> trying, you know, a suspicious package inside, I'm sure. Gate guards will be all the cool. food. Uh, we do want to open up the floor to anybody who'd like to say something. If there's anybody out there that has uh, a few words or any kind of memories, if anybody has anything, uh, just speak up. And after that, I think we can do a little show you around the station as well, kind of all the crazy stuff these guys got. Okay. Uh, okay. So we'll just uh, we'll start with the tour. We'll start with the tour and uh, get the kids on the fire engines. And I'll let them have some fun. And then uh, caterers say once they get here, we'll be able to start serving. The guys are going to help out and we'll have some lunch. So we invite you to stay. Thank you. Thanks. 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 Thanks.